Welcome everybody back to red. Oh my goodness gracious really quickly before we get into this It is saying that I, I I'm pretty sure I need to do a few things around the area before We can start doing more missions. So I'm gonna knock out this area because this was pretty close to where we were uh, when we started this video back up But we're gonna knock out this area see what the stranger mission is and then keep rocking and rolling but I got attacked instantly. All right, so I got to climb up here to see how we can help. Can't I just take out all the zombies? There we go. Okay, so there's not too many in this area. Oh shit! You get up, John. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Wait, we have the blunderbuss. That just did so much damage. No, I wanna kinda like, I wanna line them up. Oh, this is. Okay, so it really- John, keep going! Why- go! It's a good weapon. But... It just seems not very practical. Okay. This thing... Has gotta go. Oh, execute. Hold on. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Ah! Go, 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 go! There we go. Let's get the pistol out. Start wasting them. What? That get him? Whew, we gotta be... There was more zombies here than I thought that there were. Get out of here! Oh, come on! Blunderbuss! Wait, how did we get more? <laughs> it's so... It just takes so long to reload! Why did I not pick them off? Why did I not climb up here and just pick them off? Gotta make it difficult. I'm stuck on a rock. I'm stuck on a rock. John, please keep going. I think I'm making this way more difficult for myself than I need to. <laughs> That's all I have to say. There we go. How f what's the range on this thing? Oh, I see there's a fast one right behind me. Come on. Bye bye. Okay, one more. Last one. You're welcome. What does this guy want? Isn't this the camera guy? You okay, mister? Oh, oh, Mr. Marston. Well, I might have guessed you wouldn't have got the lurgy yet. Not yet. The lurgy? Is that what we're calling it? Yes, quite the hobby of yours, that. Sure. Listen, any idea what the hell's going on here? But it's brilliant. Man turned against man. 
kind-hearted neighbors turned into savage, flesh-eating monsters. Do you see it? It'll make a fantastic movie. Who would enjoy that? What? What kind of sick person would like that? Me? Most of the people I across the globe? The lowest common denominator! My people. You're gone, friend. On the contrary, sir. You misunderstand me. Come now, you're a smart fellow. Allow me to illuminate. Debatable. Listen, Mr. Marston. What I need is one of those nasty buggers that spits poisonous snot on you. If in your travels you can find a spare one, we can make moving picture history. You're worse than they are. Each to their own. Austin. But if you find the time, is that a yes? Capture a retcher from Gap Tooth Ridge and bring it back to McKenna. Makina. Wait, what does that want us to do with this? What is this? Oh, it's just a chest. Shotgun. Why were we not using a shotgun earlier? What is happening over here? Hold up. I'll save you. Did I kill her on accident? I'm so sorry. Get up. Get up. She's still moving. Get up. Whoops. First hell walks the earth and you turn up. Could my week get any worse? Bonnie! Nice to see you too, Miss McFarland. Oh, I thought you'd be dead. I heard things were bad in West Elizabeth. Sure. <laughs> but it'll take more than an apocalypse to take me down. What are you? A demon or a cockroach? A little bit of both. Oh, I fear. How's your father? <laughs> see, even John knows. Andy? He should be coming out of that barn any moment now. Oh, no. Daddy! What's he doing in the barn? Daddy, John's here! Mr. Marston, you remember? That idiot bounty hunter. I have a feeling her dad's not alive. What was he doing in the barn? Just rounding up the undead and keeping them safe so the rest of us can go about our business. He's a real man. He's probably playing around with them. Daddy! Me. Now come on now. How long's he been in there? Not long. Only since yesterday. Yesterday? Since yesterday? I better go have a look for him. Would you, John? You are kind. Call out to me if you. She knows. She knows that he's gone. That's why she won't go and look. Oh no. Is this going to be a Walking Dead situation where, you know, how Shane takes the, uh... Are you guys good or bad? Where Shane takes the porch, uh, the, the pitchfork off of the barn and just murders everyone and Sophia comes out of it? Spoiler alert. We know our way. We know how to get into this barn. We've done this before. Do we need to even go up there? Oh, shit. There we go. Oh, no! Keep them safe. Keep us safe, everybody. I'm gonna say this thing ain't reaching down there. I just do a little bit of shimmying. Climb on up. Drew, you all right? 
I have a feeling he's not alive. Drew, are you in here? He's dead. We have an arsenal of weapons. Why do we pick up the rifle? So sad. So, so sad. I'm sorry, Bonnie. I wonder how she's going to take this. Probably not too well. What the... John, you always do bring sunshine to my life. I'm sorry about your father. I'd like to say he died doing what he loved. But he never was one of those <laughs> folks. No, he wasn't. Slathering from the lips and howling at the moon. I guess I'll content myself with saying that he died protecting those he loved. Indeed. It's one way to see it. Well. Take care of yourself, Bonnie. Was that all that we have to do for them? For her? You too, John. Feels so bad. Paternal pride completed. I'm kind of confused because we still... I mean, does it want us to clear out all of this before we continue? I guess so. I guess it wants us to clear out this entire map before we do any more missions. All right, let, let's, let's get to the next town. Oh no! Come on, let him go. Come on, boy. Hey. Well, try to. Oh, wonderful. Sorry, boys. She didn't give me a whole lot of choice. It wasn't even the guy's fault, really. That got bit. Welcome to paradise. Hello, Marshal. Might have known you'd survive. What's going on? Do I look like I commune with the undead? I don't know. Well, then how would I know? My job is to take care of the folk who live here. Oh, you <laughs> heard that one. How's that going? How's that going? Well, let me put it to you this way. Cattle rustling? Bank robbery are at an all-time low. But Love murder, that. Blood drinking and psychotic episodes seem to be somewhat prevalent. Either that, or I'm dreaming. That's what I'm hoping too. How was it getting in here? It was crazy. Oh, they must be hiding again. They come in and then just disappear. The town's been nearly overrun a couple of times. Now we're low on ammunition. I'm two men down. I'll help you clear the place out if you like. We already did. Good man, John Marston. But before that, I'm gonna need my deputies back. What happened to them two clowns you had before? Gone? Maybe. I sent Joan off. Oh, I, I kind of liked them a little bit. They've both been gone for several hours now. Who'd want to eat one of them? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question. Where'd you send them? Out near the general store. Jonah's got one of these new guns. 
I'm sure he can't run into any trouble. These things, they'd stop an elephant. It looks like it's Thank just you. a sawed-off shotgun. Thank you. I'm sure you got your own troubles. That's for sure. But, you know, it's alright. We'll help you out, Marshal. What are you shooting at me for? What did I do to you? Dinner for two. Is it just literally right here? Okay, are you done? What the hell are you shooting at me for? We're on the same side, you idiot. Hey, mister. Hey, pard. You seen a couple deputies nearby? Marshall's boys. Jonah and Eli. Are they Jews, mister? They sound like Jews. I don't know. Why? Why? <laughs> this whole thing is nothing but a Jewish plot. Oh, brother. <laughs> you know that, don't you? I find that highly unlikely, amigo. Well, I don't like Jews. Or colored folk. Or natives, now that you mention it. Well, you're a nice, kind-hearted man to meet in a time of trouble. Kind does not come into it. Why? What are you talking about? Why? I bet you like Catholics. <laughs> I can't stand them neither. Nor women. Fabians, socialists, homosexuals, Asians, or British. Between them, they've ruined this country. Ruined it. It was a good country once. Now people oh, are man. each other. And it's all the fault of the Jewish, British, Catholic, homosexual elite and their ideas. Well, I, for one, won't stand for it. Can I shoot him? Have you ever met a Jewish person? <laughs> Thankfully not. Or a British Catholic homosexual? Not in my store. Oh, I, I get it. I see you acting clever. Well, let me tell you this. The Jews killed Lincoln. That's why there is a triangle on the money. And they run Europe like one of them Arabian harems. Now they've sent this here plague to kill all us decent folk. Yep. You, sir, are truly a remarkable fella. Thank you kindly. I must say, it's a rare pleasure to meet someone with such a grasp on human history. You take care of yourself. I'd hate to see you get savaged by someone and watch the life force drain from your hate-filled body. <sighs> hey, hold on there. Why don't you join me in my fight, sir? It's not too late. I fear it is for me. Then I will fight them alone. All of them. America is the land of the free. And that means free to people like me, Herbert Moon. Absolutely. Yes. Yes. Absolutely deserved it. Piece of shit. Ooh. This thing is a terrorizer. Um. Who was shooting at me and why? Um, how big is this? Okay, I mean, it's... Okay, so they're not in here. Aha! They're eating each other! Hello, boys. Marshal sent me need some help. Guess you got other plans. Seriously, enjoy your meal, no problem. Yep. <sighs> we gotta take them out. Easy now, gentlemen. Remember all the fun times we had? So much fun. Bye bye. Pretty good. Never seen you two move so fast. 
Return to the marshal's office to tell him about Jonah and Eli. All right, let's go on back. I'm back, Marshal. They're dead. Hello, John. Hello, Marshal. So, you find the boys? I found them. I understand. Oh, it was fast for them. It was fast. It was fast. And they died with their bellies full. Well, one of them did. <laughs> Good. That there's Jonah's gun. Here, you keep it. After all, you earned it. Thank you. <sighs> Take care of yourself, John. You too, Marshal. Are you gonna stay in here? You gonna go out and check on your town? I think even Marshall's like, what do I do at this point? What am I supposed to do? Ooh, a mythical creature has appeared. Hey, we got... Hold on a second. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Come back. Oh, I want that so bad. Come back here. I wonder how challenging this is going to be. Come on, John, stay on. Come on. We almost. There, ah, we got it. Nice. The four horses of the apocalypse. Hell yeah, we got the flaming horse. This is so sick. Whew, okay. I will say, man, I think it's kind of dumb that you it like we I have I haven't had a mission pop up in like an hour, over an hour. I've completed all of the city. I've completed all of the towns. And if it wants me to complete every stranger mission before we move on to the next area, that to me is kind of stupid because a lot of it is just like Fetch quest. So hopefully after maybe this one, it will let us open up more missions. We only have three. This is the... Th we have three left. This is one of the three. So after this, we only have two stranger missions that we currently have active. I just don't know why it would make us finish these before we go down to the next area or the next missions. But we have your Zambi. All right, here you go, you dummy. Ah, oh, Mr. Marston! I see art has got the better of you. Stupidity got the better of me, but I felt I should help an old friend. I appreciate that, sir. Are you ready to watch the creation? No, I don't want to watch. Do we have to? If you say so. Wonderful! Let's put the star into his first seat. Right over here. You can put him down here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> lovely, lovely. Oh, this is great. Movie making history, my friend. Oh, good gem. Out. There you go, my man. Out. There we are. And ready, ready, ready. I see you. You're going to be stars. Do something interesting now. Ah! And action! Zombies go! Oh, your hands are eat you and flesh! Flesh and flesh, right? That's right! Oh, oh. Ah! All of that for literally no reason. Perfect! I'm 
I'm so upset. Let's go. Dude, still nothing. It, it's not going to. Oh, man. So we probably have to complete everything, huh? Before we go any further. Uh, let's see. Journal. We only have two left. Literally nothing was popping up. Though we, we, I think we visited this place like two or three times and we didn't see one Sasquatch. Not one. Let's go. So let's see if anything finally pops up this time. That's not one, but... Do they only come out at night? But we've been out here at night. Oh, wait, there's one right there. Hey, there we go. We killed the Sasquatch. Kill five more? Wait, hold up. Okay, there we go. We're killing some Sasquatches. Oh, shit. Pardon me. Oh, I see you. Okay, kill four more. Why so many? I love how John Marston was just like, you damn fool, there's no Sasquatches. Come on, easy up now. Is there one around here? Aha! Poor guys, they're just trying to live their life in the woods. That's all they're trying to do. Okay, going this way, I think. Okay, so we only have to kill three more. That's all. Just an entire family of Sasquatches. I wonder what would happen if they got a hold, like, you know, if one got a hold of you. You just die instantly, basically. Come on. Let's not mess up right here, please. Oh! Oh my god, I thought I was gonna have to restart this whole thing. My heart sunk a little bit. <laughs> Okay, Mr. and Mr. Mr. or Mrs. Sasquatch. I'm coming for you. I don't see one. Aha! Yes, I do. No, 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 
Where'd it go? Okay, kill two more. Oh, that was a headshot. Kill one more. It's all the way down here. Try my, I'm going to try my best not to die. I feel like I just got out of the map in this game. I feel like we're out of the map now. And then we got to ride all the way back. I think the game's like, you want to kill Sasquatches? We're going to make you do it, but you want to kill them? Fine, we're going to put you out of the map and you can't ever get back in. Jesus, this thing is way out. Oh, he looks so lonely. I don't want to kill him. <laughs> oh, no. Shoot me, human. Shoot me. Oh, I will, you foul creature of the night. You'll be granting me peace. Why's that? Keep you from eating more babies? In the name of all the traits, are you talking about human? You eat babies. You have to to survive. Everyone knows that. Ain't your fault. We eat berries and mushrooms. Oh, no. We did. Now none of us are left. Some maniac's been murdering us. The last of my kind. We've lived in these hills a thousand years. You eat babies. If you say so, human. My family is gone. My kind is gone. So sad, man. to make us kill him. I think I have to now, man. He's just left by himself. Okay, fine. If you want to live in peace, I'll let you go. Okay, do we have to do that one now? Actually, let's go... How do we get there? So, I mean, I hope that this is... I hope that this does something. Are you gonna tell me that this has been here the whole time? And we didn't even actually have to do any of the stuff that we just did? In a time of enormous crisis, I might have known the government have you boys doing the work of a common clerk. Well, thank you for your input, citizen. I'm glad you find life so funny. <laughs> My pleasure. You think this poor girl's family finds life quite so funny right now? Family? I assume she was a common killer. She's a missing person. Missing presumed dead, I guess. But you keep cracking them jokes. I'm sorry, mister. I guess I spoke a little out of turn. I ain't the one you should be apologizing to. Just find the girl. She's 15. Millicent Waterbury. Hmm. Millicent Waterbury.
All right, I'm gonna go. F this is gonna be the last thing that I do for this video. How far away is it? Ah, man. I mean, it's kind of far away, actually. It's better be my flaming steed. No! Did, is, it, is it gone? Is my flaming... Why would my horse be gone? Damn it. I had him for like one hour. My God. This thing is... going bonkers. Can I at least have my other horse back? Whoops. Whoops, a daisy. My God, this thing has a mind of its own. I said we gotta be getting close. Can you make it? Come on, come on. Whoa there. Oh, okay. She's safe. She's alive. I'll save you. You're welcome. Are you Millicent? Yes. Come on. Your family's worried sick. Okay. What on earth? Let's get her back here. Thank Ooh. Climb on. Let's get you home. Whoops, come on. God help us. Come on. John! John Marston! I've heard that somewhere before. You from around here? I spent some time down here, but I live in West Elizabeth. I have a small farm up there. My wife and son, they've got the infection. That's terrible. Do you think there's a cure? I sure hope so. Otherwise, well, I don't want to think about the otherwise. Otherwise, we don't have a wife and kids. Oh! Jesus, man, why are there so many? Lord, Holy shit. Yeah. I'm sorry, I am escorting this lovely woman. There is no way I am getting off my horse to try to save you. This, there's not even this amount of people in the state. Well, let's say how many people we've killed. Hold on a second. How many zombies have we killed? Animals killed, people killed, undead killed, 489. Fresh undead killed. We've only killed five people. Hmm. So we have killed seven, like, what, almost 900 people? Did you see them falling at the house like a pack of wolves? It was like they could smell me in there. No offense, miss. But they could. It's horrific. Are they alive or dead? Somewhere in between, I reckon. It's some kind of punishment for our sins, isn't it? It's a curse. My pa warned me, but I didn't listen. This is all my fault. What are you talking about? I, I can't 
kissed a man and we weren't even betrothed. <laughs> Don't worry. Believe me, if that's the extent of your sins, I'm in a whole heap more trouble than you are. That's all? That's your sin? Here we are. I can't seem to get away from this place. <laughs> Here you go, I brought her back. Thank you, ma'am. Plenty of more just like him, Mr. Comedian. We got a whole host of missing folk. <laughs> oh, okay, nice. So we do. Nigel West Dickens, I see you, but all the way down there. American imperialism. Okay, guys, this has been a longer video. This, we've been recording for about an hour and a half. We cleared out the entire upper side of the map so far. Um, so I think from here, we just have a couple of main missions left, and then we should be done with the game, I, I, I believe. But thank you guys so much for watching, man. This is absolutely one of the best zombie games ever made um and i'm glad that i'm playing it i appreciate all of you for joining and checking this series out with me but until the next one peace out